Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel, TechMate. I'm your host Justin and um, today I'm going to show you how to create your own radio station. First go to winamp.com. On the front page there will be a download. Click on a free download. It will be in orange. Again click free download. On this page it should pop up a mine bin. Click here and click run. I already uh, set it up. I already downloaded WinApp so I don't need to. So you run and I just gonna X out. Once after you download WinApp, go to shoutcast.com. Dot com. Next go to broadcasting tools in the navigation bar. Scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page where it says Shoutcast DSP plugin for WinApp. Download that. Click you guys click run. I'm gonna exit since I already downloaded that. Next, go to this website, freestreamhosting.org. On this website, scroll all the way down to the page where it says register here. Again, on this page, scroll down. Again, I agree, sign me up. Sorry guys, it's taking a while. Okay, we're back. On this page, you guys can sign up. My name's gonna be Justin07 Password. Okay, well once you have registered, you'd come up to here. My account has been created. Log in here to get your server details. Click that. Okay, now we're on server settings page to get our stream settings. We already installed Windows, so open up Windows. Hit Control P. It's gonna, it should look like. Uh, You guys will not get this. That's an error on my part. Okay. Um. Um. Scroll down here under plugins. Click DSP effect and click the middle button two times. The middle one two times, and then you're gonna. It's gonna come open to this. Ari. So now for address, you're going to set it up right here, copy server IP slash host, go back to WinApp and paste it under address, server port, copy that, paste it under port, and your password will be used to sign up on the website. Now click yellow pages, description on my, s on my radio station would be Justin's radio. The URL, the URL you're gonna put is under here. T click on Tune in Links and Scripts. Now we're on this page. Scroll down, and then by default, this is what you're gonna put as your URL. So copy that and paste it under URL. Genres, just put what type of music you're gonna play. I guess I'm just gonna put rock. Now that I have everything filled out in connection in yellow pages, click encoder and switch that to MP3 encoder. Let's keep that the same. Now that you have everything done, um, you can start adding music to your WinApp, and once that, you can connect to your radio station. Oh, sorry, I got first. Yeah, turn on your radio station. So, restart your port on this myradiostream.com. Now you're on this server restart page. Um, 
My server should you should your radio station should be restored, so click here to go back. As you can see, now I have a yellow yellow circle there. That means it's waiting for me to play music. So now go back to your go back to Winnet. Try to click connect again. Now it's connected. But as you can see on this main page that I'm not playing I'm not streaming any music. So, um, go ahead and play any music from your Winamp. Now go back to over here, and I, as you can see, the green bars. That's mean I'm playing music. And over here, um, uh, it's running, it's streaming live. Everything set up right. And um, I forgot to mention that each, like on this website, as I'll tell you later about that. But um, go to default. You copy this and paste this into your um, address bar up top. This is where you give uh, other users can listen, and come in and listen to your music. As you can see, it's streaming live right now. I'm hearing music. I don't know if you guys can hear. But I'm playing it right now. This is where they can uh, come and uh, listen to their to your radio station. Now go back to free stream hosting, and um, so now I have it all all your radio station set up. Um, it's gonna disconnect for now. Um, I'm gonna show you if you ever wanna. Log back into your radio station again. If you want to, if you ever want to log back into your account again, you just click what server you were on. Like my server was s 3myradiostreamcom my dot com. So you click server three, and you log back in to your radio station to turn it back on cuz right now it sh it's off so so I'm logged in now as you can see the red circle is says my radio station is not on so go ahead and click restart and it should restart that to turn it back on and all I have to do is go back to WinApp and connect and it would connect to the server and then all you have to do is go c copy this and go back to that so now you have your own radio station. In the next video, I'm going to show you another way how to get a uh, different way how to get your radio station, and I'm going to show you how to embed the, uh, the radio station onto your website. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.